Hey, Tony here. Today I'm doing an unboxing of the Best Buy exclusive 4K Steelbook set for The Hunger Games. So stick around. So today I received my order for the Best Buy exclusive 4K Steelbook set for The Hunger Games. Here's the front and the back. Here's the spine. And here's the other side with the Steelbooks. You flip it over, you can kind of get a, a good idea of what they look like with the image. And we have the specifications on the bottom and the top. And it is, um, it's, an, it's a hard box, but not as hard as some of the other ones. Um, but a lot better than some of the flimsier boxes that we've seen. So let me go ahead and remove these still books from this set. And we'll go ahead and take a closer look at each one of them. Okay, here's a closer look at the box without the wrapper on it. It's really nice. It is a little disappointing that it has this ding in the corner, but I guess that's to be expected for the way that they shipped these. They just kind of shipped it in a box with no padding. But I do like the spot gloss on the box and the way that it wraps around. So that's that's not bad. And then we do have our first still book here. Really nice colorful image there. And then here's the back with all the districts. I like that. It's like a plaque. Then we open it up. We have our digital copy. And we got our front and back together. And we have some discard. So we have our um, Blu-ray disc here. And our 4K disc. And some inside artwork. So really nice and colorful. Okay, we got our second movie, Catching Fire. Really beautiful looking still book here with the back. Open it up. We got our front and back together. Really nice looking. And then we do have our Blu-ray disc with this disc card. And our 4K disc. And some inside artwork. So made the gods be ever in your favor. And then the reverse here. The odds are never in your favor. The odds are never in our favor. Okay, next up we have Mocking Jay Part 1. Some more beautiful looking artwork. And then there's the back. Open it up. We got our front and back together with our Blu-ray disc with some discard and our 4K disc with some different discard and then the inside really nice looking artwork and then lastly we have Mocking Jay Part 2 with some um, nice looking artwork and then here's the back really nice open it up we got our front and back together i do like the way that they put the title on the spine with the roman numerals at the bottom so that's really nice we do have some inside artwork um, we have our blu-ray disc here with some discard and our 4k disc with some different discard And another nice image on the inside. So really nice looking still books. So that was my unboxing of the Hunger Games box set. So other than just a few minor scratches on the first um, movie, The Hunger Games, the rest of the set looks pretty good. Um, but overall, I'm really happy with this set. I do like the artwork. Um, I do like the packaging. I'm, I'm really happy that they quit doing the metal cases that always end up being beat up. And I do like the fact that they used a little bit harder um, card cardboard for this, um, unlike what they did for the Indiana Jones set. So I'm really happy that they have the dividers in these. So it's a pretty nice looking set. Please leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think about this particular Steelbook unboxing. And also let me know what you think about the Hunger Games movies. Now, my wife and I did see all of these movies in the theater as they were released. We really did enjoy them. Um, 
mostly the, the um, first two movies and then they kind of went downhill from there. But overall, as a, as a complete movie series, I thought they were pretty, um, pretty fun to watch. So it's really nice to have this particular edition in the collection on 4K. I did want to take time just to show you the regular 4K releases with the slipcovers that came out several years ago. So we have the Hunger Games 1, and we have Hunger Games Catching Fire number 2, and we have Mockingjay Part 1, and we have Mockingjay Part 2. Um, so I really do like the slipcover editions, but it's really nice to have a nice steelbook set for the 4K release. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I really appreciate it if you would subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and on TikTok. And if you'd like to find out what I've been watching, you can find me over on Letterboxd. I do have links below. But thanks again for watching, and we will see you next time.